Hello again, it's me, Lego Larry. Today is February 10th, 2018. These are some of the finds that I found over the last week. Um, I'll just start from left to right. I found this Lego Indiana Jones set today at a yard sale for $5. And I already had a partial set with the instruction manual, but I didn't have the minifigures. And this one's complete. I have uh, everything that is supposed to come with it in there. Uh, bag number four is still sealed and all the minifigures are there so I was really happy with that came with the manual so for five dollars you can't beat it and Indiana Jones sets are Indiana Jones sets are getting harder and harder to find so I was really happy with that I found this Lego set at Goodwill and they had that marked at three ninety nine. Um, the only bad news on that one is when I got it home it was missing uh, the Scout it's called the Scout. It's the computer module that um, does all the work for the robot. So I've got parts and pieces in there. I've got all the manuals. So I don't know what I'm going to do with that. It's got a motor in there. Uh, so maybe I can just get that Scout component and have it fully functional again. And then I've got these PS3 motion plus controllers I've never had these before um, I thought they took batteries but they just charge right in the system and these sell for a pretty good amount if you have the pair like I do here I've seen them go for like $45 and I paid uh, $3.99 for these at uh, Value Village I got this NES Advantage today uh, the guy was asking $8 for it uh, so I told him I think about it. I walked around, and then I came back and I told him if he take five, he said he take six. So I ended up paying six. I tested it out and it works great. So I thought that was a good deal for six dollars for an NES Advantage. Um, the next yard sale I went to, I got the Sega Genesis controller in really good condition. They were only asking two dollars for it, <clears throat> so I paid the two dollars. That was a good deal for an official Sega Genesis controller. I'm still looking for the six button controller, but this one will do for now. Got this Polaroid camera at Goodwill for $2.99. It's got film, I tried to take a picture with it. Uh, it didn't develop. And I think the film is just too old, even though the battery pack is, the battery is still okay. I got Avatar Blu-ray. It's got two discs, a DVD and a Blu-ray. I paid $2.99 for that. Um, but that was a pretty good deal. Then I got for the GameCube Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles. That was nine ninety nine. It's complete, and the man, uh, the disc is in mint condition. And then I got this Halo uh, helmet, and it's got the base. The game is not in there. But it came with the box. The box is pretty beat up. It's really dirty. Uh, I try to clean it up a little bit, but that's the reason I bought it, because I usually find these without the box, and I actually find it with the box this time, um, and the game is easy to find, you find it everywhere, I can complete it that way, um, but he was asking 20, I offered him 10, and he counted at 15, and we disagreed on 15, and so I paid 15 for that, and it's really cool, I mean, I've always wanted one of these, they're cool to look at, cool display piece. So yeah, um, I'm going to try and start making videos again on uh, all my finds. Yard sale season is just beginning here in Phoenix uh, because the weather is really nice in the mornings. So please leave a comment, like and subscribe. Thank you.